Meet the Sikh architect who designed some of Punjab's most iconic buildings and who would be commissioned by the Queen of England to help design the Darbar room in her home. Bhai Ram Singh was born in 1858 in Batala into a poor carpenter family. Moving to Amritsar, he would work as a carpenter and his work attracted the founder of the Mayo School of Arts, John Lockwood Kipling, who invited Ram Singh to the school. One of Ram Singh's first works was the Mayo School of Arts at Lahore. He would also win an open competition for the design of Atchison College in which the best architects in India had submitted their designs. He would be invited to England by a duke in 1890 and while working he also received a royal commission for the Queen's new Darbaru. She describes meeting Pai Ram Singh briefly in her diary. A very intelligent, pleasant, nice man, a Sikh. We looked at sketches he made for the decoration of the room. Along with this, she asked her court artist to paint Pai Ram Singh and is the same one that I used in the beginning of this video. This painting is now hung up in the Osborne house where he designed the Darbaru. He would come back to Punjab and about a decade later in 1904, he would begin one of his most iconic projects, the Khalsa College of Amritsar located on GT Road. Khalsa College is one of Punjab's most recognizable landmarks and is said to be the high point of Ram Singh's architectural career. Some of his other works include the Islamia College at Peshawar and also the Battle of Saragadi Memorial Gurdwara in Amritsar. From working as a carpenter on the streets of Amritsar to becoming one of the greatest architects that India has ever seen, Bhai Ram Singh's story is one of great inspiration. Thank you for watching the second episode of the Sikhs of Modern History. For the next episode, we will discuss Maharaja Bhupinder Singh of Patiala, his role in colonial Punjab's politics and his conflicts with the Sikh masses.